what is the meaning of self actualization what is the meaning of being self actualized have you heard of the term self actualization being self actualized i am sure you you heard of it whoever has read has known the very famous the very popular even very common maslow's hierarchy of needs that is the pyramid maslow's hierarchy of needs having different levels you will be able to understand now you will be able to recollect right that the self actualization it is shown in that particular pyramid that it resides at the very top and also many of you have understood that self actualization can only be achieved i'm referring from the maslow's hierarchy of needs self actualization can only be achieved that is one all one that is once after all of the below levels of that pyramid are met are achieved are experienced that is the bottom of the pyramid was or is the physiological needs air food drink shelter sleep etc etc the next was safety needs protection security order law stability etc the next going i'm just it is going upwards all right so the next need as as per maslow's hierarchy of need is belongingness needs that is family affection relationships etc the next is esteem needs achievement status reputation recognition so as per maslow's hierarchy of needs you must have learned that self actualization can only be achieved once an individual have experienced have achieved all of these four needs physiological safety belongingness and your esteem so many have an understanding that self actualization is all about living your materialistic life living your family life and going on a journey where you want to be self actualized but what if i tell you this is not the actual meaning of self actualization many people they think that self actualization can only be attained can only be obtained when there is complete detachment from the material world and pleasures what if i tell you that self actualization has nothing to do with detachment you can be a self actualized person while being in the materialistic world you can be a self actualized person being in a family being a family person being or having your normal professional roles and responsibilities met you can be a self actualized person in your day to day life it has nothing to do with only attaining a very old age after retirement when you have experienced and you have achieved everything then you decide that now i want to go in a path of self actualization and i am leaving everything behind this is an incorrect notion of the word the meaning of self actualization so self actualization you have to understand this and it is coming from me you have to understand this because i am teaching you this very beautiful concept 
of self actualization which according to me everyone should experience you listening this particular video you watching this particular video even you should also understand experience the real and true meaning of being self actualized what is that see self actualization all right it has nothing to do our self actualization neither instructs you to ditch, detach yourself from personal family life and professional life nor does self actualization instructs you to get detached from your innate human needs self actualization is just a certain type of a mindset a highly positive and a highly virtuous mindset that is what self actualization is if i have to describe the meaning of self actualization in one particular line in a single line it would be it is like that that you can own everything but nothing owns you it means you can have everything and every success in the world but nothing controls you and your mind it means living your life by its true purpose meaning and value that is what self actualization is so if i want to tell you certain characteristics of a self actualized person and whatever i'm about to tell you these are all true these are found in people who have already achieved self actualization these are the characteristics which are factual all right so what are these characteristics a self actualized person will embrace the unknown and the ambiguous a self actualized person will accept themselves together with all their flaws a self actualized person will prioritize and enjoy their journey not the destination a self actualized person will be motivated by growth and development they will not be motivated by only with the satisfaction of needs a self actualized person will live with a sense of direction and purpose a self actualized person will not be troubled by small or irrelevant things a self actualized person will be grateful for what they have in life and will be grateful for where they are in life a self actualized person will identify with and will have a concern a genuine concern towards humanity and its well being a self actualized person will always be humble and down to earth so these are the characteristics of a self actualized person now you must be thinking i'm sure you must be thinking you must be asking your own self that am i a self actualized person have i have i achieved 
सेल्फ एक्चुअलाइजेशन वेल आई कैन हेल्प यू टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट आई कैन हेल्प यू विद दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन ऑफ योर्स दैट इज इफ यू आर रियली वॉन्टिंग टू नो if you are really seeking that whether you are a self actualized person or not or how much close to you how much close you are towards being self actualized all right again what i need to do what you need to do is you have to answer again certain questions be honest be absolutely sincere be true to your own self when you are answering these questions then only you will be able to realize correctly whether you are close to that is towards self actualization or you are very much far from self actualization you will definitely know this when you answer your own self the following questions question number 1 how okay are you with embracing the unknown and the ambiguous question number 2 in what ways haven't you made peace with your flaws and imperfections question number 3 in what ways do you fail to enjoy and appreciate the journey that you are currently on question number 4 in what ways do you naturally rock the boat and not conform to the status quo or status quo however you want to pronounce it question number 5 in what life areas do you prioritize materialistic happiness instead of personal professional growth and development question number 6 what changes must you make to make your efforts seem more meaningful efforts towards your life efforts towards your work considering both your personal and professional life areas question number 7 in what ways do you allow yourself to be affected by irrelevant things by small things question number 8 who are or what do you have in your life that you don't show appreciation for question number 9 are you more invested into being liked by others or are you more invested into making a very impactful difference a positive difference and the last question which i want you to answer your own self is in what ways have you been negatively influenced by society or social norms so when you genuinely when you honestly when you truthfully answer these 10 questions to your own self taking your own time all right and not being distracted while answering these questions all right when you do this exercise when you finish this exercise you will definitely know whether you are close to self actualization or you are far from self actualization so i hope this video benefits you i hope this video enables you towards your path of being self actualized all right i hope you will utilize the benefits and learnings of this particular video to your fullest in a wise optimistic way all right 
सो थैंक यू हैव अ नाइस डे एंड बी हैप्पी